Welcome to Profit 100, Sales Tuning by Experts. We present Microsoft MapPoint for Realtors. Part 2. In the following example, we will show the offices of two major real estate companies. We have created an Excel sheet with all the addresses of the Collier International and Avizen Young offices throughout North America. We would like to import these addresses onto our MapPoint map. To do this, we will open the Import Data Wizard and select our Excel sheet, Real Estate, North America, plus Cities. But before we take this step, let's go back and take a quick look at what we're actually going to import. Here we can see the listed addresses of all the offices of Avise and Young and Collier International throughout North America. These are all the addresses we are going to import. Let's switch back to the Import Data Wizard. We have selected our Excel data and can now click on Open. You'll first select the Avise and Young addresses and click on Finish. Now we will select Pushpin and change our Pushpin set name to Avise and Young. As our Pushpin symbol, you will choose the flag with the Avise and Young logo. Here, we can select which information should be shown on our information balloon of each office. We will unselect latitude and longitude as well as city and click on Finish. We have now imported all the addresses onto our MapPoint map and have marked the offices of Avise and Young with pushpin flags. We will now proceed the same way with Collier International. We will open the Import Data Wizard and again select our Excel data. Now we will choose the addresses of Collier International. Again we will select Pushpin and choose a Pushpin symbol, in this case the flag with the logo of Collier International. We will change our Pushpin set name and unselect City, Latitude and Longitude. Afterwards we will again press Finish. Together with the Avise and Young offices, we have now also marked all the offices of Collier International with a flag pushpin. We would now have a direct comparison of these two major companies. Here we have shown the complete globe and the map of North America. As you can see, we have marked all the offices of Collier International within North America with a pushpin. Let's zoom in and take a closer look at the map. If we click on one of the push pins, its information balloon opens instantly. It informs us of the street address, the city address, the country, as well as the name of the manager. If we scroll over and click on another push pin, the previous closes. Let's grant ourselves an even better view with the IC Tool Interactive Viewer. Let's take the call year office in Phoenix as an example. To do this, we will press the CTRL and left mouse button. The IC Tool opens. Here we can choose from Google or Bing Maps. In this case, we will work with Bing Maps. Let's zoom in. Here we can see the state of Phoenix and a red pushpin marking the office of Collier International. Of course, this program offers us the possibility to have an exact view on the office itself. We will use the bird's eye function. As you can see, we are now able to see the building of Collier International as well as the area surrounding it. We can rotate our view as well as zoom in or out. Let's go back and take a look at our map. If we want our push not to be shown on the map any longer, we can simply click on Call Ye International with the right mouse button and select Hide Push Pin Set. All the push pins disappear from the map. Now, for instance, we can right click on Vice and Young and select Show Push Pin Set. All the push pins which mark the Avise and Young offices are now shown across North America. This was our second presentation of the MapPoint Tool IC Interactive Viewer for Realtors. Thank you for your attention.